39. Which sentence is the best summary of the research procedure used in the study in the excerpt? Okay, summary questions basically require you to recap the key points in order. Basically, go back to the text and see which is the best description of the course or process of events. They must progress over time in the answer. So, A, researchers had a group of non-English speaking students learn new English vocabulary by matching words and images on a computer screen and also by analyzing words in context. Semicolon, some students exercised and some students sat still while working. Okay, that's not incorrect. I mean, they did have non-English students study English vocabulary, images on the screen, and they even analyzed words in context, which is important, and some exercised and some did not, okay? But that's not really our best summary because that does not indicate any progression of events. Notice the connections are semicolons and 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 and. Everything's additive together here, like it all is grouped to one. So it's got the right material. It just doesn't feel like the best summary. And I think that's because it's not progressing over time. So I don't think A is correct. In fact, let's go back and check how the items progress through the actual passage. So the process of the study begins basically in paragraph six. They first recruited 40 college age students who are trying to learn English. They next then divided the students into two groups. Some did not exercise, others did exercise. And they described how they exercised the ones who did. Both groups then learned their new vocabulary words by watching words on a screen and trying to put them into context of sentences. And that occurred afterward. By the way, this took over eight vocabulary sessions over the course of two months. So we have a progression, a sequential process here. 40 were recruited, then divided into groups. One half exercised, the other didn't. And then they both took tests, vocab tests, and then more contextual tests. And afterward, they were rested. Let's go back and check the answers to see which one follows that ordering. Researchers first divided non-English speaking students into two groups. Yeah, I mean, before they selected the students, but we'll see if any answer even includes that. So they first divided them into two groups. One exercised and one studied English that did not exercise. Then... After instruction, students' learning was assessed. I mean, that's correct. And by the way, that gives an order of events, first and then. This is a, a progression. B could well be our right answer here. C, researchers first, okay, we got a first, had non-English speaking students sit on stationary bikes and pedal for 20 minutes before instruction, 15 minutes during instruction. Okay, note this is too much detail. It's not important that they biked for 15 minutes or 20 minutes. That is not a summary. That's a detail. So that's probably going to make C wrong. Then after rest period, students indicated whether English sentences made sense. Well, that's not all they did. They took a vocabulary test too. So we have missing items. We have too much detail, not a summary of the key points. Although this one is in order. D. Researchers asked non-English speaking students to study English while sitting or biking. Okay, right away we got a problem. It's not telling us they divided them into two groups. Then the students' vocabulary skills were assessed after a short break and also after a break of a full month without having their studied any of the materials. So this is not quite right. This is not exactly the right order. There's no indication that they're split into two groups. Then their skills were assessed after a short break period. Well, again, it says vocab skills. It doesn't say anything about their deeper learning skills. This is not the correct summary, D. The correct answer for 39 is going to be B. It has the right order. It hits upon the key events or occurrences without providing too much detail, without leaving out any key parts. B is the correct answer for 39.